I'm Evangeline Mantler. I'm a junior. We are from Burke High School. <laughs> this poem is called Bones. Skeletons have always fascinated me. In my dreams, I run my hands over their ribs like xylophones. I let them swing. Clack. A ghostly wind chime. A macabre orchestra. I'm infatuated with the way they have nothing to hide. All they are is out in the open. But the marrow that makes them up is a toxic elixir for me. As a child, skeletons were intriguing. How could this element of ourselves be so unknown and uncomfortable growing up? I learned it was because skeletons are never supposed to show. They are the behind the scenes crew of our creations, the silent spectators of our struggles. Concealed inside closets, skeletons mean secrets. But there's not just a skeleton in my closet, there's, there's one, one inside, inside of me. You. Sticking through at odd angles and exposing, exposing the, the hidden, hidden truths my body is built upon. From the moment I could think, I created two selves. The skin you show is the biggest lie you've ever told. She says we're two selves, but really, I'm the one in charge, each day settling deeper into her body. It's at the center of my being now, my spine. There's no way to remove me. I'm a part of her. I've always been uncertain where my spinal column ends and my cranium begins. Seems like the secrets spread from my spine to her mind. When these thoughts rattle my brain's bars, yearning to break free. There's something inside of me that needs, needs these, these thoughts secrets to stay its own. As if the secrets can build a wall of protection like the rib cage I built for myself. By stacking up half-truths and omissions, each rib slides into place and keeps another part of me inside. Organs locked up and protected. A heart that can never escape. There was a point when my heart stopped. Listen. The beating was stilled and all was silent. Listen. No blood pumping through this dull body. Listen to me! Then my rib cage was cracked by those cutting me open. Extracting my bones in a vain effort to heal her brought revelation. Addiction. The harsh light of operation only left me more broken. Released. Vulnerable. Redeemed. Bare. Unchained. I felt the snap once I could no longer stop. Now, I've, I've broken, broken so many, many bones I can no longer recognize them. them. Can't tell my pinky from my thumb, my tibia from my fibula. There's an anxiety. Freedom. That, that comes from exposing, from exposing the skeleton, skeleton within. within. See, I've been carrying this bag of bones like a walking coffin. And although they hold me up, the secrets weigh me down. I'm so tired of fighting my need for secrets. You may as well be buried. These bones seem infallible. But the one problem with skeletons is, is that, that you're, you're dead. dead.